be the other player because you know physics are cool but they are kind of hard to use. I'll do it. Wait a second. <laughs> nah. <laughs> yeah, I won. That is. Night game ripoff. It's a game about uh, aristocrats collecting their camels for a camel race. Hope that makes sense. And uh, you collect them with. Uh,
So you can only keep like the height you're at, but it has a hard time flying too high. So you have to use the steam to get you. And since we're four programmers, I can. Oh. Now says there, so there's no original art in this game at all. It's all stolen. Yeah, that's basically the game. We got some buttons, some more puzzles. Uh, so you have to push, uh, pick up the stones and put them on the button so you can get some steam going and get around a little. Yeah, any questions? So you're this guy, and you need to rescue your three friends who are like yelling at you. I love you. Yeah, exactly. So the thing is, is it started as a defensive game with these uh, monsters coming down the screen and attacking you, tower defense. But um, essentially, I realized the point was for the player to win, not to be annihilated. So I, there's this turret, and you are completely 100% safe because you will kill anything that comes to your base. Uh, you tell your guys to advance, and you shoot. Let's see if I can not die here. Probably not. All right. So I rescued one guy, and he's a sniper. And so each each of these guys you rescue has a different weapon that's good against different monsters. <coughs> Snipers have a longer range, and they one-hit anything, so these really tough monsters up here. Uh, so I'm going to try and dodge across here for this guy. Right, and I'll let you play the game, but each unit has different stuff. That's my game. So I decided to make a Metroidvania game, and uh, I didn't really try to do anything original with it. So basically, it's just a platformer where you explore this kind of small world, and there's some pretty good initial stuff. There's a bunch of different enemies in the game also. <laughs> what does the circle around you do? Uh, yeah, exactly. And it recharges if you don't play it by enemy for two seconds. What words did you have? I had uh, liquids, which I guess is the blood, and uh, junction, and I guess that kind of fits into the game because you can take different class at specific areas. Uh, and I also had pickles, which I kind of skipped out on. So yeah, that's my game. <laughs> 